In this example, I'm going to solve this equation by factoring. So I see that all of my terms are on the left side, and they're equal to zero, so that's where I need to be. So let's go ahead and factor this left side expression, and it looks like I have the sum of two perfect squares. So I know this will factor as the square root of the first one and the square root of the second one in a special sum of squares formula. So x plus, and the square root here will be 6i, and then x minus 6i equals 0. And then I'm just going to use the zero property of multiplication, which says if I multiply these two and I get 0, it means either this equals 0 or this equals 0. So I'll go ahead and consider both cases. x plus 6i equals 0 and x minus 6i equals 0. So in this case, when I subtract 6i from both sides, x equals negative 6i. And in this case, when I add 6i to both sides, x equals positive 6i. So I can put both solutions together and say x equals plus or minus 6i. And I solve that equation by factoring.